We have an update for you tonight on an NBC 15 reality check. Back on Wednesday, we told you about a Mobile tire shop owner who says the city of Mobile forced him to pay $11,000 to have a fire hydrant installed in front of his shop. Well, tonight, NBC 15's Justin Moore brings us the city's reaction. And Greg, we press for answers, and the city of Mobile is confirming to us that they did require this tire shop owner to install this fire hydrant. It's a lot, I mean, so but thanks God, I mean, we made it, but I'm trying now to see if I can get my money back, that's all. I talked to Imad Azim this week about him footing an $11,000 bill for this fire hydrant on the city right away on Spring Hill Avenue. He paid Moz to install the hydrant after the city of Mobile inspectors told him he must have it before opening up his small tire shop, Triple A Tires. Azim feels he was taken advantage of because he's not from Mobile. I don't know really what's the rules and stuff like this, but so that's why I got not really, I don't have a really answer about what they asked me for, you know what I mean? According to this statement from the city of Mobile, Azam changed the footprint of the building and changed the business type. Under previous ownership, it was a restaurant. Azam turned it into a tire shop. The city says that triggered the fire code requirement. In the statement, it says the city does enforce building codes, which sometimes require business owners performing new construction to pay for public infrastructure, equivalenting it to homeowners having to pay for sidewalks. The city also points the finger at Zim for not requesting a pre-development meeting with the city. I talked to the tire shop owner today. He's upset. He told me the city should be trying to help his small business instead of hurting it during this pandemic. He now plans to hire a lawyer. In Mobile, Justin Moore, NBC 15 News.